Hello Taurus, Sun, Moon and Rising. Welcome to your April love reading for um, 2019. This, is re this reading is for couples and um, we're going to use the Tarot of Sexual Magic and the Gilded Tarot to do the reading, okay? So we'll go into your sensual life and see what's how it's going to be for most of you in April, okay? So tell us what's coming for Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising for their sensual and passionate life in the bedroom. How is it, you know, their sex life going to be in in April? <laughs> Taurus. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What's coming for Taurus? I feel like I need to pick this one. Okay. The hanged man. Although it's a woman. Sexual pleasure. Let's see. Okay. Alright. Okay, so we'll read and see what the hanged man or woman says in this book okay right it says sacrifice bonding a strong bond even if platonic magic action against impediment and impotence so um it looks like there's going to be a lot of bonding going on and your sexual or you know sensual life is going to be um a, a lot more risque because it says bonding um and sacrifice so i think there'll be a lot of interesting games going on in the bedroom um, but let's see what the Gilded Tarot says about how the first the, the first week is going to be the beginning of the month of April for Taurus, Sun, Moon and Rising. Tarot, please give us some answers. Please. Oop. Please tell us what's going to happen. For Taurus, the beginning of April. Okay, please give us some insight, some knowledge. Okay, okay. For Taurus, okay. This one has fallen out. The Nine of Cups. So at the middle of the month of April, how is it going to be? For Taurus, Sun, Moon and Rising. Whoa, Ace of Swords, and what's going to be the outcome at the end of April? How is Taurus going to feel in your love life? Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Tara, please give us some. Oh. Queen of Swords. Okay, I'll take that. So, let's give it a moment. Mm. Can you all see? Oh, yes, you can. All right, so. You are going to have your wishes fulfilled in terms of your emotional um, needs with your partner. Because this reading is for couples, okay? And some of you are going to be really, really... Um, I feel some of you will be going on dates. You'll be very, very happy because this is a wish card. And then, so if this is a wish card, it's the happiness card. 
and so some of you are going to be feeling really romantic because don't forget you will also be bonding on a on a different level <laughs> yeah so um yeah it's going to be a fulfilling time for you at the beginning of the month of april taurus and i feel for some of you you are going to be having some mental clarity about whatever decisions you want to make i'm saying this because the bottom of the deck is the seven of cups okay so it could it could be that some of you have got a lot of things on your mind and at the middle of the month of april you are going to come into uh, at a point where you're going to make a decision a, de a decision that is going to affect your relationship the right way because um, I want to clarify what this ace of swords here because this also queen of swords it looks like that you need to have some form of discussion so let's consult our clarifier what Taurus needs to you know what the ace of swords is here for Taurus in the month of April so Tara please give us a clarification for the um the sword here okay we've got six of swords we've got another sword yeah so another another one clarification for the ace of sword for Taurus please please give us a clarification this wants to jump up we've got knight of pentacle and then six of swords Hmm. Yes. Okay. Right. So having the six of swords and the knight of pentacle here, I feel as a clarification for the ace of swords, for some of you things have not been going too well even though this is saying from the beginning there's going to be you know this you've got the wish card here yeah so this could be that um some of you your wishes are going to be fulfilled however some of you too um this could also mean that you you have a wish you know to move forward with the relationship the relationship you have right now because maybe things haven't gone according to plan yeah and um i mean the knight the knight of pentacle is is like a work in progress so i also feel like for some of you it's something that you have been working on um so at the middle of the month of april you're going to have the clarity to move forward and this is going to be um, a mental journey. Also, having having um, this um, knight here, you see the horse is not actually moving. This horse is not really moving. It's just come to a standstill. So um, I feel this is going to be more of a moving on mentally because this is clarity. So whatever, you know, you have been working on on your relationship, which I feel has been going on for quite a while because, you know, this night he takes his time. He's not in a rush at all. If, if let's say, he's going to, um, you know, build a house, he's going to take his time, you know, because this guy, he's got his book. He's got everything he needs. So he's not in a rush at all. 
is not in a rush. So I feel this is something that has been going on for most of you. Um, but at the middle of the month of April, you're going to have mental clarity about the stormy time you've had, you know, and you'll be moving forward with your relationship. Because this is something that has been coming taking it taking a while to happen some of you yes definitely that's how i feel I, I i feel like this is um you know some of you who are working hard to maintain your relationship you're working hard to maintain your relationship because this guy here is an earth sign guy and so definitely you, you're looking for for stability in your relationship you know a relationship that you can depend you feel like you know it's a strong thing and having this clarity here you know and this is the clarification you've got another sword which is moving on so um, you are going to have mental clarity and whatever you have been going through with your partner that has been stormy you are being you'll be moving forward to um, a better place so if that is what you or some of you are wishing you are going to have your wish you see men, you know mental uh, clarity so that's that's for some of you but some of you I feel as though um, you'll be having lots of fun lots of fun yes And yeah, so this is this is where you make your, um, you know, your your voice heard, because once you've got the clarity you want, you want to speak up. Yeah, you want to speak up, and then get to where you want to be. And as we can see, you'll be moving on to uh, a better place mentally, and emotionally, of course. So. Um, your wish will be coming true in terms of your love life and um, I, I, I think this has been insightful for you and so we'll leave the reading there for you Taurus and you can also check the general reading yeah and I'll definitely see you next month I mean next month as in may <laughs> okay now thank you for your time taurus